Hello everyone, welcome to Automation Community. In this session, we are going to see about binary increment in Omron PLC. Kindly like and subscribe our channel for more updates and videos. So, what is this binary increment instruction? So, it's going to increment the data which is inside the word address. Okay. So, the instruction will be like uh, you know 2 plus mark this is the instruction shortcut so let's see that in the program let's add plus plus d100 let's take the same address what we have seen in the example and here also we have to give pulse input okay so let's connect this and change this input to pulse all right all set to go so let's add the watch table no need of actually add the watch table because here we can this is the decimal you can check there itself okay so let's have some value here let's take zero let it be a zero only so give just one pulse the value is one for the next pulse two okay this is like a counter so it will keep on increment the d100 okay so what will be the uh, uh, you know the end value so there should be the limit for the decimal right so, till that it will be moving like that. So, for that I will make this to normal. So, that it will be getting the continuous input. So, for the continuous input it will keep on incrementing. You can see the highest value. Once it is reaching the highest value, again it will start from 0 and increment. 0 and increment. If you are not stopping this, it will continue to increment. See, I am turning on this. Look at this. How fast it is moving. Look at this. It will up to go to 60, yeah, 64,000. After that, it again come back to 0 and it started incrementing. Okay. That's what we have to give it as a pulse. For every pulse, it will be moving 1, 1, 1. That is what it is binary increment. Okay. So, until you make this to off, it will be continuously incremented. See, it is off means it will stop. Again, if you turn on, it will increment. Okay. So, like this, it will be working. So, same like that, we have a binary decrement also here. So, we have a 2 minus symbol. So, what it will be doing for every pulse, it will decrement the value. So, increment is to increment, no, this is to decrement. So, let us see that in the same page. Add one more input. Alright. So, here we will add the minus. We will give the same address so that we can see one increment and one decrement. Okay. And I am going to make both as pulse. Okay, go for simulation. Let's start with ten. Okay, so now I'm incrementing, so it goes to eleven. Okay, now what will happen if I decrement the pulse? 1 will go less. So, again it will come back to 10. And now, one more pulse if you give, it will move to 9. See, 9. So, like that, 
you can decrement if you increment it will go to 9 so i have given the same address d100 d100 okay so for our better understanding i have used the same address so whenever you are having an application like one increment have to uh, done whenever uh, one pulse is coming you want to increment some value means you can make use of this binary increment and binary decrement instruction in omron plc so i hope you have understand the concept i'll meet you in the next session with another interesting topic thank you